We want to multiply using the distributive property and combine like terms if needed. The distributive property is given here below, where if we have a times the quantity b plus or minus c, we distribute a, which means we'll have a times b plus or minus a times c. Looking at our first example, we have 9 times the quantity negative 7x minus 5. So to multiply, we want to distribute 9. So we'll have 9 times negative 7x minus 9 times 5. Let's go ahead and show some work. Again, we have 9 times negative 7x and then minus 9 times 5. Now let's go ahead and find our products. We would have negative 63x and then minus 45. So this is our product using the distributive property, negative 63x minus 45. Now I do want to mention, after we do this a while, we'll stop showing this step here and we'll find the product by just doing 9 times negative 7x is negative 63x and then 9 times negative 5 is negative 45 so we'd have minus 45. Looking at our next example, we have 8 times the quantity negative w squared plus 3w plus 5. So to find this product, we distribute the 8. So we'll have 8 times negative w squared plus 8 times 3w plus 8 times 5. Again, let's show the work. So we have 8 times negative w squared plus 8 times 3w plus 8 times 5. Now simplifying, we have negative 8w squared plus 24w and plus 40. Again, we should our work here, but after a while we'll just distribute the 8 and think negative 8 times negative w squared, negative 8w squared, 8 times 3w is positive 24w, so plus 24w, and 8 times positive 5 is positive 40, so plus 40. Now looking at the next example, we have negative, and then the quantity 7t squared minus 3t plus 6. We can think of this two ways. We could just take the opposite of this trinomial, but if we want to distribute, we can think of distributing a negative 1. Let's go ahead and distribute a negative 1. So again, we'd have negative 1 times 7t squared minus negative 1 times 3t plus negative 1 times positive 6. Again, let's show the work. So we'd have negative 1 times 7t squared. Now here we have minus and then negative 1 times 3t. And then we have plus negative 1 times 6. Simplifying, we have negative 7t squared. And here we have minus negative 3t, which becomes plus 3t. And here we have plus negative 6, which is just minus 6. Or if we're comfortable not showing this much work, if we distribute negative 1, we'd have negative 1 times 7t squared. That's negative 7t squared. Now for the next product, we think negative 1 times negative 3t, which is positive 3t, so we have plus 3t. And our last product is negative 1 times positive 6, which is negative 6, so we write minus 6. So once we're comfortable not showing this work, we can find these products much faster. And now for the last example, we have 2 thirds times the quantity 1 eighth x plus 1 sixth, so we distribute the 2 thirds because of the fractions, we definitely want to show the work here. So we have 2 thirds times 1 eighth x, and then plus 2 thirds times 1 sixth. Now let's find our products. Here there's a common factor of 2. There's 1, 2, and 2, and 4, 2's, and 8. So here we have 1 twelfth x. Looking at our second product, we have another common factor of 2. There's 1, 2, and 2, and 3, 2's, and 6. So here we have a product of 1 ninth, so we have plus 1 ninth. In this example, it is best to show the work that we did below, because if we did distribute here, we would have to simplify after multiplying. I hope you found this helpful.